be called a one minute owl. I want to talk to you about a drill that I developed that works on a lot of basics and some good fundamentals that you just need to have. And it's a fun drill that I like to shoot every day when I go down to the range. So I call the drill the one more drill, one MO for one minute out, right? We're always striving for one more, right? Whether that's one more sight picture, one more magazine change, whatever it is. Anytime that we can do one more fundamental in any of our daily shooting, you know, that's another repetition that we get and that we see. So I always try to drive that home in my training and I'm driving that home here with this drill. So this drill uh, to start, you know, we're gonna have a five second par time for each of the different parts that we're gonna shoot. So you got five seconds to engage and each part is a little bit different. Uh, we're going to shoot this drill from anywhere from three, five, seven yards, all right, build up to wherever, you know, you feel comfortable, whatever your skill level is, and continue to push the target back. But the beginning of the drill is a little bit of dot torture, all right, so you're going to shoot from the draw six rounds into the first dot, all right, so you'll have a part time of five seconds, all right, from the draw, six rounds, all inside a two inch circle, so this dot. Now there's a few things that dot drill does for you and what this drill does. First off, it's gonna work on your draw. It's gonna work on good sight picture, keeping your eyes focused on the dot and down here, not on your red dot or your front sight post, all right, because you're gonna see this start to fluctuate if your eyes move into your front sight post. Our focus needs to be here on the target and on the threat. So our eyes come here, all right, we're gonna shoot six rounds. Obviously, we've got to shoot them at a fairly quick pace, so if you get too crazy with your trigger finger, you'll start pushing and manipulating the pistol, and you're going to see that by having rounds to the left, low and left, whatever it is outside of this circle for a right-handed shooter, opposite for a left-handed shooter. All right, so you've got five seconds from the draw, six rounds in the first one. Once you're done with those six rounds, all right, take one more sight picture. So you always want to, after every drill that I do in any of my training, whether I tell you to shoot two rounds, three rounds, four rounds, I always want you to, after the drill is done, to refocus onto the threat, onto the target, reprep trigger, be, always be ready to put another round in there. Because in an everyday carry situation, when that threat pops up, we want to eliminate that threat, but we want to stay focused on it and make sure that threat is down and eliminated before we put our pistol away. So don't get in the habit of every time you shoot a drill on the range that you shoot bang, bang, and then you just bring the pistol back in and you're nonchalant. No, we always want to shoot bang, bang, and then, all right, I'm ready, triggers prep, sights are right there. I could put another one in that X ring, but that's not the drill, I'm done. Okay, look, holster. All right, so five seconds, six rounds, first stop. Right? Make that additional sight picture. Your first magazine will have 12 rounds in it. So after that, you're ready to go. You'll hit your timer again. You'll get another five seconds, six rounds into the next dot. Now, when you're done here, you only have 12 rounds, so you're going to go dry. You should get a slide lock. So I want you to go ahead and go through slide lock reload, represent the pistol onto one of the dots, all right? Pick a threat here and just refocus, reprep the trigger so that you're ready to go, all right? And then we come back and holster. Your time is just the rounds and, and what the pro timer is picking up for hits. So we want six hits inside the circle within those five seconds, but go ahead and do that additional sight picture. When you're done here, go ahead and do that mag change and then pick up that additional sight picture. Just build that really good muscle memory for those everyday carry situations. All right now, that next magazine that you loaded is only gonna be a three round magazine. With that three round magazine on the next five second par time, all right, from the draw again, timer goes off, you have five seconds put three rounds inside the three inch square, conduct a slide lock reload, three rounds into this box right here, then you should go dry again with a slide lock. I want you to go ahead and take, it'll be that fourth magazine that you're gonna lock and load, represent the pistol back out there, take up another good sight picture so that you're ready to shoot another round. So for every drill and every part of this, you're always gonna take an additional sight picture and or go through a next mag change so that you're building that good muscle memory for those situations when you may get into something out there when you're everyday carrying, you always want to be ready. All right, we don't want to run our gun dry and then that's what we did on the range all the time and then do to do, what do we do? No, we always want to go through that reload. We always want to prep that gun, ready to shoot again, prep the trigger, align our sights so that we're ready to engage any other threats that may pop up. And that's kind of one of the things that this drill hits home. All right, so again, it'll be Total of four magazines, but you have a break in between here. So if you need to reload and you only have two magazines, you can still do this drill with that. All right, so the first magazine will have 12 rounds to be able to do six here, reset, six here, go through the reload, three rounds, magazine change, three rounds. So this will be five seconds, five seconds, five seconds. All right, we're gonna shoot this anywhere from three, five, seven yards, 10 yards when you get really good, okay? But, and you can change it up 
do it however you want, add more magazine changes in there, you know, have fun with it. For this drill right here is going to be as we described. So let's go ahead and set up the target. Let's shoot it. All right, five second par time. First magazine that's inside my pistol is 12 rounds. All right, so on the timer from the draw, I'm going to come up into the first dot, six rounds into the first dot on the left. After that sixth round, I'm going to go ahead and make sure I take up a seventh sight pitcher. I'm ready to shoot, ready to engage if I needed to. Then I'm going to come back and holster. Next one, we still have six rounds in here. All right, five seconds again on the dot. We wanna shoot six rounds, try to get them inside the dot. Remember, we're gonna go through, I should have a slide lock, so we wanna go through a magazine change. Once we're done, present back out and be ready to engage if we needed to. For the next one, we've got a three round magazine in here. We're gonna have our next three rounder. All right, now we wanna pick up either another 12 rounder if we wanna shoot the whole drill again, or just a full magazine. So this one here, we're gonna have five seconds. So we're gonna come from the draw, come out. Now we're gonna shoot the three inch box on the bottom left, three rounds inside the box. We should have a slide lock reload, go through the reload process, push the pistol back out, three rounds again. We should get another slide lock reload. Go ahead and do another reload and just get the pistol back out there to the threat. Prep trigger, good sight picture so that we're ready to engage any follow on threats that may come up. There you have it, the one more drill. One more, one more sight picture, one more magazine change. Change it up, have fun with it, do many different variations just so that you can get in all the different variations of training that you need so that you're ready for any situation that you may have in your everyday carry. <laughs>